So here we are, we are eating fat into the gut. And you'd be surprised in healthy people that happens in a period of five minutes after fat enters into the circulation. So once it's dumping the fat into the fat cell or it is giving fat to the exercising muscle, the muscles we have in our body for consumption or to store for future consumption, it becomes much smaller and it's called a chylomicron remnant. So this fat-filled globule, globule becomes smaller, it's called a remnant and that's cleared up by the liver. And you would know you have normal fat handling by looking at a few key pieces of your blood work. So you can look at your triglycerides, if your triglycerides are less than 100, if your good cholesterol or HDL is greater than 55, not less than 55, I just noticed that I made a mistake out there. And invariably when you have this situation, the so-called bad cholesterol, which I call the other good cholesterol, is over 150. And your total cholesterol usually is over 200. So the question is, how does fat toxicity happen? So let's say you are metabolically unhealthy, you have become overweight, you are type two diabetic, you are insulin resistant. Now I threw out a term called insulin resistance and I'll define that later, but for now just keep that in your mind. So if you are insulin resistant and you have obesity or type two diabetes, the fat cells are already filled and overstuffed and inflamed and they say we can't accept fat anymore. So the fat backs up in the circulation. The muscles can take only so much fat. And by the way, you will see that our muscles can also get fatty. So they refuse to accept fat, so fat backs up in the circulation. The liver similarly will say, hey, I can't take any of these fat globules or the remnant globules, so they also hang in circulation. So the way you know that is that you will have high levels of triglycerides, low levels of good cholesterol, and a series of other blood markers that I will explain to you. But what you will end up is what is called ectopic fat deposition. So what ectopic fat is that fat that remains in the circulation is trying to find a place to park itself. And it parks itself in your liver, in your heart, in your pancreas, and in your muscles.